Well, pink was the color today, and Tyler, as many in the city, sported it in support of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And while the weather put a damper on some celebrations, the party went on for breast cancer patients, survivors, and their caretakers at the Texas Oncology Center. CBS 19's Ladarian Cole here in studio with a special story from today's event. Ladarian. And that's right, Brian. As you can see, I'm in my pink, and this event was filled with things to bring joy and smile to those who attended, including a mother-daughter duo, both breast cancer survivors, who met a lady today who passes out little booklets like this one, filled with inspirational messages that many would agree are much needed during the battle against breast cancer. Lifting spirits during difficult times. May this album bring you hope and comfort for about a year now. Surround yourself with those who make you happy. Rosina Becker has delivered these pocket albums to cancer patients and their caregivers receiving treatment at the Texas Oncology Center in Tyler. And I pray over each one of them as I'm making them so it will bless the individual and the caregiver. Her husband's cancer diagnosis was her motivation to join a national movement and become a local Albums of Hope distributor. It, there is inspirational messages, inspirational quotes, inspirational pictures, everything to bring joy to someone's life that's going through a difficult time. So far, Becker says she's given out at least 600 albums of hope, including two today to this mother-daughter pair. Just to know that she was so sweet and so caring to share her her encouragement of her little booklet that she gave me to look back on and know that we're not alone. Holly Wellmaker, just four months free of breast cancer, always had a partner in her fight against the disease. Her mother, Betty Hodges, a breast cancer survivor for 27 years now. Always encouraged with each other to get us through what we've been through. Her earlier in the years, but me just recently. She was a large part of my care team, not just my daughter, my friend. We have traded positions, and it's been a beautiful thing to be even closer but to know that I could get through it, she could. But for those who may need a little reminding, Becker will always have an album of hope to share. I know that this is going to bring joy to others. Even though it's difficult, it's still going to touch others, and that's what I'm all about. Becker was just one of a few people to surprise the patients and survivors today with special gifts. Everyone who attended was also given a gift bag sponsored by Spade. And the proceeds raised at today's event through food truck sales and lemonade sales will be donated to the Susan G. Komen Foundation. In studio, Ladarian Cole, CBS 19.